Hello and welcome to my channel, Boo Snakes and More. For more video like this, also watch my other house channel, A and A Snakes and Stuff, my youngest son's channel, Hanny's Toys and Games, or my oldest son's channel, Little Chris Ten. And once upon a time in the shadowy realm of Eldora, Eldora. there existed a seductive succubus named Corinne with Eldora. raven black hair Corinne? cascading down her shoulders and eyes that glowed with an otherworldly allure. She was known for her bewitching charm oh, and commanding presence. Yes. Oh, oh, oh! The bitch from Dad's work did you call her? Corinne ruled over a Cascadian <laughs> domain. <laughs> hey, um, imagine she watched Where mystical video. energies intertwined oh with mortar desires. Her lair, hidden within the veils of darkness, became a haven for those seeking forbidden pleasures. However, Corinne was pleasure. not just Sex? a temptress. She was a shrewd sex? and powerful succubus yeah, with sex. a reputation for being both be alluring this. and bossy. Now, what, what, what pleasure are we talking about? Pain or sex? Because One day, a curious mortar named Aiden, Aiden? stumbled upon Aiden? the entrance the to Corinne's realm, intrigued by the mysterious <laughs> allure. Damn, damn. Is he ventured what into the, the depths of Elder Eldora. As he crossed the Ma threshold, he found himself. Did he this Aiden? No, the story oh. did. Ensnared by Corinne's enchantment, Corinne, with her penetrating gaze, assessed Aiden, sensing <laughs> both valuability and untapped potential. Oh. She decided to keep him close under her command. Aiden's life took a thrilling, thrilling turn as he became entangled in a web of passion and intrigue. Corinne's influence over Aiden grew stronger with each passing day. She guided him through the <coughs> secrets of her door, revealing the hidden wonders and perils of the supernatural realm. Why, her aura was undeniably seductive. Her bossy demeanor challenged Aiden to discover strengths he never knew he possessed. As their journey unfolded, Corinne and Aiden encountered, encountered mythical creatures, navigated treacherous landscapes, and faced more dilemmas. Corinne's allure, coupled with her commanding presence, created a dynamic between them that transcended the mortar in supernatural realms. In the end, the story of Corinne <coughs> and Aiden unfolded as a tale of self-discovery, where the lines between desire and empowerment blurred. Corinne's bossy nature, far from being oppressive, became a chrysalid for Aiden's growth and understanding of his own desires. And so, in the shadow, shadowy realm of Eldora, the succubus and mortar forged an unusual connection, one that defied expectations and left an indelible mark on the fabric of their intertwined destinies. Thank you for watching this video, and peace out till the next one.